Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Audemars Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota 4Runner TRD Sport. Now the most notable features on this TRD Sport is its blind spot monitoring. You also have your power moonroof along with your backup camera. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota 4Runner TRD Sport. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this TRD Sport is its daytime running lights. You also have your fog lamps and as you can see you have your accents for your uh, lunar rock color just on the grill as well. Taking a look down below you will find the front facing camera and taking a look up top you do have the hood scoop with this model. Over on the side you do have the 20 inch aluminum alloy wheels, down facing camera on both sets of mirrors and then you also have integrated signal lamps, foldable mirrors and heated mirrors and then taking a look on the inside of the mirror you're going to find your blind spot monitoring indicator. Now with that indicator it will actually light up just loading it. There is another vehicle right beside you and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is Lunar Rock. Now taking a closer look on the inside, taking a look at the front dash as well as the front seats you have your black interior power driver's seat with lumbar support, mirror controls, automatic high beams, you have your view which I'll show you what that is a little bit later on here, on and off switch for the rear cargo power outlet with the window wiper de-icer, window locks, power locks and window controls. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your seek function, volume control as well as your mode select, Bluetooth connectivity, scroll function and your lane departure alert with your cruise control. Now it is equipped with the push button start so you have to do is put your phone on the brake, hit the push button and it will start up for you automatically. It's taking a look at some of the controls that you'll find just on the multi-informational display or some of the options. You have your fuel economy, distanced empty eco indicator with your digital speedometer and sway warning. You can also go through and take a look at your audio, lane departure alert, messages, and settings menu with the lane departure alert, pre-collision system, blind spot monitoring on and off with the rear cross traffic alert as well. Now, taking a closer look at the center dash area, you do have your digital clock, hazard lights, and then if you go inside your menu screen, you'll find your audio phone apps as well as a couple of other additional features. Now with the apps menu, it's part of the Entune app suite so as long as you have it on your phone you can use such apps as the Scout GPS app which allows you to stream your maps from your phone onto the touch panel display. You can also check on local fuel prices or on the latest sports scores just depending on what your preferences are. It does have the Sirius XM satellite radio on here, dual zone climate control settings, USB and power outlet with your 4x4 select, and it's mounted to an automatic transmission with your TRD style shift knob. Open and close for the power rear window with the heated seat controls for your driver and passenger. Auto dimming rear view mirror and then if you take a look up top you do have the integrated garage robot controls, trash control on and off, A-track downhill assist control with your SOS connect and open and close and tilt up and down feature for the power moonroof. Taking a look at the backup camera, as you can see, you have those nice guiding lines and they're making things much easier for you when you back into a stall. And as you can see, you can also change up the backup camera view for yourself as well. Now, when we put the vehicle into drive and we hit that view button that's just located at the very uh, far driver's side there, you'll notice that you'll be able to see a front end view of the vehicle, which makes things a little bit easier for you, especially with underground parking. Now, if you want, if you hit that auto feature right there, Anytime that you're driving anything under 10 kilometers an hour, it'll actually stay on that screen. Anything above that will go back to the previous screen you were on. Now when you hit the view button again when you're in park, it'll actually show you the front end view as well. So that way, just before you pull out of the driveway in the morning, you can see if there's anything in front of you or behind you when you put it into reverse. Now when you push the view button once more, it'll show you the side view as well, which makes things easier for you as well. And then once more, it'll go back to the previous screen you were on. Finally, we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located just on the back of the tailgate, you'll find your backup camera just on your left hand side and the rear hatch release just located underneath. Now closing in on the rear cargo space, as you can see, you do have the cargo cover in the back, which is great because you can cover up your valuables just while you're going from place to place. And then if you need more additional space, you can fold down 
the rear folding seat for yourself as well. The other nice thing is that you have a couple of areas located on the left, right, front, and back side where you can tie down some loose cargo, just so it's not shifting around in the back, just while you're driving. You also have the rear cargo power outlet, so if you're ever out of the cabin or the lake during the weekend, you need to plug in your tools, you can do so. Or if you'd like, you can plug in a mini fridge or a couple of speakers. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Audemars Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Phone number is 780-410-2455. Or please visit our website at sbtoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day, and I hope to see you next time.